Okay, hello friends. This is uh, Milka from Mega Stitches, and I'm going to show you guys what I grabbed from the freebie table at StitchCon 2021. I'm going to try to do as quick as possible. Um, but yeah, uh, they, these little patterns all came in a bundle. They, they were with a rubber band. And I grabbed it because I don't know why, but every time there's some that are done like i think they finished this one if you can tell but the pattern is there and i mean we if if i want to redo it i can just replace the threads and the fabric is no problem and these are like little maybe ornaments or very small pieces um i grab these little packages because i'm usually I find people that I can teach our craft and they want to learn and this is a perfect little kit to start to learn uh, how to cross stitch. So yeah, these were the ones that I grabbed and they all came together with a little rubber band. I also grab this frame let me see if I don't make you too too dizzy but it is it is a wooden frame and I thought it was cute and I thought I can FFO something very nicely with this and it has a very deep um, I don't know how to, to, to say what it, what is this but you know when you put the cross stitch and the sticky board and all that, it becomes very thick. So it's pretty nice that it's, uh, it has depth to it. So yeah, I thought it was cute. I also found these thread tucks, which I've never seen before. And basically you put your thread in, it has a little hole, and you literally pull your thread and your thread keeps keeps it clean and I thought this was like genius seriously and you can also use it for critic apparently um this was in the freebie table it brings a bunch I will try it and if if it's you know if it doesn't work for me I will just give it away alrighty what's next <laughs> look what I found people <laughs> I found the tweeny weeny bikinis. Doctor is the doctor is in. Oh <laughs> by Meridian Designs, the police call box. And I mean, yeah. But I saw these series and I really wanted to stitch one of these. So it was fun to, to see it over there. Uh let me see, because I kind of have these things way too far. There you go. Maybe this is better. Oh, I forgot to show you. But I'll, I'll you know, I'll just show you at the end. I found my passport. And this is, this was my, uh, kind of like a, my badge. <laughs> it, it had StitchCon 2021, my name, where I'm from, Columbus, Ohio. Uh, my floss tube name, my Instagram, and which weekend A or B I was attending. So I attend to weekend B. And yeah, it was pretty nice. I'll put this in my journal. I found this um, kind of like a bread napkin. I think that's how you call it. I keep calling it napkin. I don't know if it has a, a different name. But it comes with like the Ada, like already attached to it. And it's pretty neat. Like, do you see this? So you can like stitch anything in the center or in the edges or whatever, because you know, it still has the, the holes. So I thought this was cute and it gave me an autumn feel. I don't know, so I grabbed it. I've never quilted before, but I'm thinking about it. And I have a sewing machine. And I thought this was uh, maybe 
a good start. I'm not sure, but this is the pattern. Oh, I found this from Little Family uh, or Hickory Hickory Hollow Little Family Treasures, and this is the one for Father. A father is a classic growing in a valley in a value every year. So I thought this was going to be a cute um a cute gift for the hubby. He loves classic cars. I love classic cars too. And then we got this um Perforated paper ornament is an angel and it brings the thread and the perforated paper. Look at this, people, from the Cricut collection. Yes. Isn't this beautiful? It's called the Valle 